two Sundays of My Story Must Change. We are first time visitors all the way from Namibia, Ventuk, capital city of Namibia. And we are excited today for this service that God will change our story. I want to see a miracle. I want God to heal me and and bless me also. This is my first time here today. Um, I've I've heard about the church. I've actually came across it um, on YouTube, and it actually really, really um, touched me. I decided that I want to come and and just uh, experience the presence of God because. Um, you don't find this all the time in, in, in many churches that, uh, where the word is preached and demonstrated uh, the power of God. That the Lord told me, he said, my son, take up two Sundays and prophesy. Speak into the destinies of my people that I shall honor every word that thou shall release for the story change of my people, says the Lord. The Bible says, believe the Lord your God and thou shall be established and believe his prophet and thou shall prosper. I stand on the mandate, the commission and the mantles of my prophetic assignment to decree and declare over your life and family and career and destiny and finances that thou shall make a significant progress this week. I don't know what forces of darkness that are trying to stop your destiny. I've got a good news for you. Destiny here, Pastor, have been loaded into the atmosphere of your week and next week to come. You shall see a miracle. You shall testify by the power of the Holy Ghost. God said, I have made you a God to your circumstances a God to your predicaments a God to your afflictions a God to every trouble in your families the same way I made Moses a God to Pharaoh you shall be a God to every stumbling blocks in your life says the Lord stories are changing destinies are changing Lives are changing. Healing is taking place. Fire is moving. Jesus is blessing you. I greet you all today. Wow. I have been in churches, but I have never been to a gathering of the saints where the Lord is here, where the Lord is going ahead of his servant. It was a great service. It was an eye-opening service. I can boldly say all things have fallen unto me in present places, for I saw it all. What I have never seen, I saw it happen. I've always heard God say in his word that um, David was the apple of his eye, and I linked it to his dance, and we saw today we danced like never before. We danced and we could feel the glory of God. It was, it's in this ministry, there is dimensions of things that are done, that if you are here, focus, you will learn a lot. It is not only the praise and worship, it is not only, it's just so, we, I could not comprehend it. I didn't even know that just praise can open heavens. I did not know that just a dance, just a jump can open heavens. I sang a song in Afrikaans that I did not know, but it, I could feel it moving in my veins, moving in my blood. I am glad if one of the greatest things ever God has done for me is bringing me to Cape Town, is bringing me to be under the honorable, under the most loving lover of God, John Anosike. Pastor John Anosike, I, I don't know how to express it, how to explain it, but he has taught me to love God. He has taught me to serve God. Come and witness it for yourself. Don't stay back. If you are around South Africa, it is not only for you to watch. Take that flight, take that bus, be a partaker of this Sunday service. If you are out of South Africa, you can still connect. 
distance is not a barrier. The God of our father, the God of John Anosike will locate you. So be here and your story will change. I can attest to it. My story has changed. The brilliant they knew long back. I, as I get, go out today, my life has changed. I am already feeling it. I'm walking in it. I'm speaking in it. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for making us to love God. Not only have you taught us about God, but you have taught us about prayer. You have taught us to partake. You have taught us to run the race with you and on our own. I'm honored. Very rare men are available. Most of all, um, our mama who has taught us the power of sacrifice, the power of giving. Many a times Christians out there, they do not know much about giving. Tune in when our mother speaks, you will really learn a lot and you will be a seed sower, you will be a giver and your doors will open. Thank you. Are you addicted to drugs and substance abuse? Are you in an abusive relationship? Are you depressed? Are you oppressed by demons or afflicted? Are you stuck in one place with no sign of progress? Are you struggling in a business? Come and receive a supernatural release of finances with the bond servant of Christ, John, 31st July, 2022. First service, 7 a.m. Second service, 10.30 a.m. No matter how low life has taken you or how hard that situation has made your life become, your story must change. Venue, 416 Vortrecker Road, Maitland, Cape Town.